like I said, we're going to be very limited what we can take by way of questions. We're going to have a lot more information that's going to be coming out with the Raymond shortly. I can't get into that. That has to remain part of the investigation. The investigation is not complete. There's still more that is going on with the investigation. I believe some of that will come out at the arraignment. Um, I really can't speak to that at this point. What led you to uh, Mr. Panero? What was sort of the evidence that uh, exposed that this was a case of arson? Great police work, great firework, a great investigation. Everyone working together piece by piece, going where the facts led us, and that's what's led us here today. How long, is, how long has he been has living? Has he stayed in this area? Has he tried to flee the area at all? Or has he stayed around here? He's been in the area. How long has he lived in that, did he live in that apartment, that house? And state his name one more time so we get it right. Momo Kamara, we'll get that to you. We'll get your spelling. I don't know how long he exactly lived there at, at 5 to 7 Wall Street, but he had lived there. Was he arrested without any hassle or anything? Or did he give an indictment for how to I believe he was arrested without incident, yes. And the Worcester Police did a great job uh, uh, with some surveillance and making sure, you know, the community was kept safe. They did what they needed to do. He was, he was there for a burglary, Joe? I can't comment on that. Uh, he is charged with... Yeah, that'll come out at the arraignment a little bit, but I, I, I can't, right now I can't say, speak with regards to that. Again, a lot of that's a part of the investigation. He was not a resident there at the time of Did the fire. Did he know the police? Uh, not really. Not really. Well, what can you tell us about his criminal history? I can't tell you anything at this point. That'll come out at the arraignment. Was he in any kind of relationship with someone who lived in the home? He did know people in the home, yes. Like a girlfriend, a former girlfriend? He, he did have friends. I can't go any further than that. That'll come out at the arraignment as well. Thank you very much. All right, thank you. Thank you.